אבל תמיד מפריע לנו בתמונה. אני חושב שזה ריבר, ואחר כך עם הכבוד של הרעיון. אז כבר מיליון שנים הראשונה, הרעיון של הריבר פיוקה התחלתה לסלול את הלימסטון. and then forming all the tunnels, the chambers, so all the empty spaces you can see here inside. For example, uh, the tunnel we just passed with the train, till 1.5 million years ago, in that part, the river was running. But then it found a crack in the limestone, solved that part, and went down. So today it's still inside the cave, but 50 till 100 meters under our feet. And there it's doing the same job as here, so building new tunnels, new chambers, now actually it's just enlarging all the spaces that are beneath us. But when the river left this part of the cave, the formations you can see around you started to grow. We call them the spiliotems, and they are growing again with the help of water, just not the rain, uh, just not the river water, but the rain water. So the water that is on the surface is first going through the soil, then through different layers of limestone, solving a lot of things on the way, and then coming into the cave. Because here the atmosphere is different from the one above, uh, the water starts to deposit the limestone, and it depends where, they get, where the limestone gets deposited. We have different types. Uh, one stalactite can grow to a stalagmite, and in one point they combine, 
and then a column is formed, you have one on the other side. So, stalactites, stalagmites and columns or even pillars, of course, uh, they are forming when the water is dripping down, so we call them even dripstones. We have even other formations that are forming when the water is slipping, and one of those are called the curtains. You have here some smaller ones, but if you're re really careful, you saw even one with the train. It was really big, really beautiful. So the curtains are forming when the water drop is not so heavy to fall down, but instead it's just slowly slipping on the wall, leaving the calcium carbonate on the wall, and then the curtains are formed. All the formations you can see around you, they are growing really, really slowly. One millimeter from 10 to 30 years. So the media of growth is one centimeter per 100 years. And because of that, it's really important that you don't touch them. I already told you that if you're touching them, you leave the fat that you have on your fingers and the dirt, and then a black layer is formed on them. And because of the black layer, they are not growing anymore. Because water and fat don't go together, so then the water is just slipping down and cannot leave anymore the calcium carbonate on the black part.